Welcome to the Smart Lab Activities How To Demo Series. This demo is how to use Label Reveal. I'm in a notebook file on a new page and I'm going to create a Label Reveal activity. This activity helps your students learn specific parts of an image. On the top menu, I select the Smart Lab icon. A list of the lab activities appears and I select Label Reveal. The Label Reveal dialog box opens and the first thing I do is either draw an image or add an image that I have saved to my device. I'm going to browse for an image and select the atom diagram. My image appears and now I can start adding labels. At the bottom, I click Change Style and I select the line and arrow style to use with the labels. I can select one color and all the arrows and lines are the same color. Or I can select the multiple color option and each labels line or arrow will have a different color. I'm going to select that. Next, I click within the image to add a label. A label field appears with a line. In the text field, I'm going to type my term, electron, and I'm going to move my line's arrow to point to the electron. I want to move the label a bit, so on the left side of the label, I grab the handle, these vertical dots, you can see my cursor changed, and I move the label to where I want it to be placed. During the class presentation, I want to collaborate with the students to define each label. At the bottom of the label, I'm going to press this down arrow, and this opens a note, and I'm going to type in the definition of electron. This field can hold up to 150 characters, and when I'm done, I click the Done button. I'll use the same process to add in all my other labels. When I'm done adding in all the labels and definitions, at the bottom, I click Finish. My activity builds and then appears on the page. Each label appears as a question mark icon and you can ask the students to identify each part of the atom. The students can collaborate on each part and then click the question mark when they're ready to reveal the label. Because I added a note to this label, it has a plus sign. I click the plus sign to open the note and we can discuss the definition together. Once you reveal your labels, you can click them again to hide them. Also, at the bottom left of the activity, there is a Hide Show Labels option. You can use this option, for example, if you want to start the class without the question marks appearing. You can click this to hide the labels and then click it again during the class to show the labels when you're ready. If I want to change something in the activity, I open its notebook page, and in the top right corner of the activities player, I click on the pencil icon to open the activities dialog box. One last note before I end this demo. You can add a game element like a buzzer, timer, or randomizer to this activity. I describe these game elements in the demo, how to add game elements to a smart lab activity in this how to demo series. Thanks for watching. Check out the other demos in this How to Demo series.